Hey guys, and today I'm going to show you about my skate park. So as you can see, I have those fingerboards and many things for them. Like this, sliding down stuff, slipping on the trail, then stairs. They're not kind of like stairs that to go down and up and down. Those are stairs that you have to like jump over. So yeah, and I have two of those kinds of stairs. And we're going to start, I'm going to move everything out the way, and we're going to start with the stairs. So about the stairs. Those stairs are pretty good to like only jump from. And you can move them like this, and then boom, and it's really fun. Okay, the stairs are done. Well, I have those, all of those kinds of skates, yeah. This one is the fastest skate I have. It is so cool. And it has this wheel in the middle, which I have no idea what's for. But I think that's what makes it go fast. And it's so fun. This skate is pretty good for tricks. You press on the back and then like jump off. It's really hard because you need to like press on the back. And then like jump off with this. Oh no. <laughs> I know it's really hard. So. I have this one. It's actually from McDonald's. It's really cool. It has some drawing on the back but. Not really good for sliding as this. This one's, you would think, how could this be good for sliding as a wheel? Actually, those sides are pretty slippy and pretty fast. This one's the fastest one. Then this one is my favorite. It's so realistic. He has even got a picture at the back. And it can, probably this is more like a trick one. This one's more like a trick one, yeah. And you can do different tricks on them. You could put your finger on the bottom and then flip it and then land on it like this. Sometimes it doesn't work and it just lands like this with the wheel in the top, but it's really fun when it lands. The second one, you can press it the side and then make it land like this and then land on it yourself. Then I got this mini plastic one. If you know, those are really cool. They're probably more popular than the wooden ones. It's like a plastic one. Yeah. This is a really small one. I don't know why I have it, but I just have it. Probably on the hearts, you can pull like the fingers. But it's super tiny and I don't think it's for tricks. I mean, at least it's not for my fingers. Because my whole finger is bigger than the skate. Okay, now we're gonna try instead of the stairs, the slipping bar. Let's try the McDonald's one. We're gonna have a competition of whoever wins. So we're gonna try the McDonald's skate. Okay, I got it. Oh no, we got stuck. Again, again, ah, uh, no. Not really. It's not really good, so take this one out. Now we're gonna try this one. It was made in China. The trick one probably will be good, yeah. It slides so good. Then let's start from the other side. Yep. Okay. We're gonna try this one, which is really good at sliding, the plastic one. I don't I think it's even made for sliding because it has this kind of circle shape at the back let's try my favorite one which is i find the best at sliding this behind this the picture is so slippy i could just do this and it's so slippy okay let's try the last key that i actually said is it has the wheel but it's pretty fast still This one is really cool. It could just hang on the bar like this, and it just stands here. 
So the next competition is we have this is the best. But probably this one is the best, the McDonald's one, because you can go down and it's really easy to just turn on it. So how to turn? I'm gonna teach all of you how to turn on this on the fingerboards because some people just do it. just take it and then like take it with their hands and then turn it around. Oh. So you need to press on the back, then turn. Then you can press on the front, which was the back. Then you can go. So it really helps by sliding down. Yeah, it really helps for sliding down and then turning around. I think the McDonald's will be the best at it, but we don't know yet. Maybe even my favorite one will be the best. It's really easy to turn on it. And it's really fun. It's so fun. You just press on the back, turn, press to the front, kind of got stuck. No, like, if you get stuck on the edge, imagine in the circle, you got one moment. So imagine you got stuck in this hole. Usually, people just who likes to play with skate like with fingerboards they would just take it off and keep on playing but what you should actually do is try to press it to give all of your weight at the back but not all the way because then you can't slide press a bit like this slide back and then press at the front and you're free i know that's just so cool okay we tried this one pretty good the next one will be this plastic one I never tried like playing with the plastic one so much. I really just play usually with uh, McDonald's one, my favorite one, and then the fast one that has a, the wheel in the middle. That's actually called Skate Boy. I don't know why. Skater Boy. Okay. Probably the red one, the plastic, this one. It's pretty hard to turn because the front is not curvy and it turns really bad. It has this, it leaves those lines that I really do not like. The mini skate. I think this is just made for a mini skate. It's like, I think the mini skate wins at this challenge. My favorite one wins at the bar. And then I think this plastic one wins at the stairs the mini one wait we haven't tried the big one yet it just sometimes it gets stuck and i don't like that but really it's just good nothing wrong with it didn't get stuck this time this one's pretty bad because when you try to go down the wheels are not so high and then this thing it gets stuck like this just laying the wheels won't work so you gotta try from the top stand at the bottom Turn around, it's pretty fun, right? It's pretty fun, yeah. But you still gotta, when you go down, press a little bit so it doesn't get stuck. And then if you want me to race all of those skates, subscribe so you can, so you don't miss my new video. All of the skates race. And then we can see who's actually the fastest skate. Maybe it's not a skater boy, maybe it's not. Maybe it's the one that's from McDonald's. You never know. So I'm gonna race them in the, ne in the next video. It was really fun making this video with you guys. If you wanna see more about my skate park, or if you wanna see me race all of my uh, uh, fingerboards, subscribe so you don't miss the video. If you, let's get, Mm, 20 likes on this video and then I'll and then I'll post a new video about race bye